So let's jump into our first headline here. BRICS now richer than G7 says Putin. The Russian president says the economic group is crucial to the formation of the multipolar world. The BRICS nations have taken overtaken the G7 states in terms of the purchasing power parity, PPP. Uh, of their populations. Russia President Vladimir Putin said on Monday in an interview with China and the media group, and he went on to say as for BRICS, at the time of the summit in Johannesburg in August, the ratio of the economies of the G7 countries and the BRICS countries was already in favor of BRICS in terms of purchasing power parity, Putin said. BRICS currently comprises Brazil, Russia, India, China, South Africa, but the group will be joined in January by Argentina, Egypt, Ethiopia, Iran, Saudi Arabia, and the UAE will be joining. The G7 Club of ind Industrialized and, and Developed Countries consists of the U.S., Canada, U.K., France, Italy, Germany, and Japan. So that's very interesting how that this was all formulated after World War I, the formulation started. And then during after World War II, you started to see it really start to take sides. The Cold War kicks off. The Korean conflict. You got all kinds of stuff kicking off. Okay, let's keep going here. So what do we tell you? We warned you about this. And this is the upcoming aftermath here that we're going. So we went into telling you guys five years ago, China going off the petrol dollar. U.S. dominance is coming to an end. BRICS nations to use gold back currency. And then I and then we warned you back then also new Amero dollar to be a reality. So the answer to this is BRICS now richer than G7 Putin. The answer to this is what we said here seven years ago, the new Amero dollar to be a reality in North America, looking to implement digital token by 2021. So I was off on that prediction. But my opinion, U.S. dollar becomes de-dollarized. Brazil is abandoning the U.S. dollar. And as this that happens, Dilma Rousseff is creating a gold back that was the previous, previous three administrations ago in Brazil, backed BRICS nation currency that will force, and then I guess, again, it's to force the 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 Amero to unify. Because if the Amero, Amero unifies, if United States, Canada, and Mexico unify, then basically what could happen is it could rival this currency that they're putting together. But the problem is the Western countries actually need to unify and actually start producing, fabricating, exporting, and creating a healthy GDP, right? So there it is right there, folks, for you guys. And we talked about oil wars ahead via BRICS. They are working towards a fake energy shortage, refinery closures ahead five years ago. And in my opinion, as cities go broke, they will need to fund their BS spending by creating fake shortages to allow for more hidden taxation as inflation creeps in. I have been bombarded with emails.